Hey guys! Welcome back to another video. Make sure to like and subscribe to get featured on all of my future Sonic content. You, we, you have to join the Sonic Army. Yes, that's what I'm calling you guys now, the Sonic Army. Yep. <laughs> so yeah. Anyway, today I made a video around like two weeks ago about, basically about the best, and some of my best, um, Freddy's, the best Sonic 3D games that I know. And, so yeah, this video is kind of similar to that, but it's going to be a little different. Basically, the difference is, is that we're going to not just be talking about the 3D Sonic games, we're going to be talking about, not the 3D Sonic games, we're going to be talking about all the Sonic games. And I'm not talking about, like, the ones on my opinions. I'm talking about the fans' opinions. So yeah, just remember that because some of the Sonic games I haven't played yet. So I've only played like 10 in my whole life. Since I've only been obsessed with Sonic for like 2 years. And I'm more into his merch than his video games. But yeah. So let's go on with the first one. Sonic Boom Rise of Lyrics. Yeah, this is one of the most hated Sonic games of all time. I've never played Sonic Boom, Rise of Lyrics, or the Sonic Boom period. I do have a couple Sonic DVD t show, TV shows, like like Season 1, Season 2. Yeah, I own that stuff. Some toys of Sonic Boom. But I've never played in the game. But I'm not opinion. I'm not taking this on my, like, my recommendations. These are just most of the Sonic fans, fan base. Basically, what I'm saying, the most of the Sonic fan base, pretty much all of them, hate sonic boom and the, one of the number one obsession basically the most i'm gonna say the most biggest sonic fan yes someone's bigger than me speed supersonic i watch him pretty often and he doesn't even like sonic boom rest of the lyric and that's asking something because he's a big fan so yeah anyway a lot of people hate sonic boom and I mean, I've never played it, but it doesn't look that, that bad. And I know I'm going to get a comment about, hey, um, by that one YouTuber that wrote a whole paragraph about saying that Sonic Forces isn't the best Sonic game. Sonic Free and Knuckles is. Yes, I, I, I read my comment, so comment down below on the video what you think. But anyway, when, let's just get back on the track. Why do people hate Sonic Boom? And I don't see why. It looks fun. I've never played it, so... Maybe I should take a shot one day, but why do the fan base hate Sonic Boom? So let's go on number two. I wish to cleanse my father's sin. And I wish to talk to Sonic once again. that image is stuck in my head so yeah after i showed you that clip of a human kissing a hedgehog you can already tell that this is the worst sonic game in history i'm saying that i hate sonic 06 i might get a couple merchandise of sonic 06 one day but i hate that moment this game sucks and Eggman looks too realistic. This deserves all the hate it's got. I hate this game. I've never played it but the fans hate it and I'm a Sonic fan and I hate this game. I don't even care about the hand style. Whenever I play it I'll never buy it. I'll never do it again. This is the worst Sonic game ever. You guys shall never buy it. It's $30 at GameStop. If you want to have nightmares and ruin your day, this is the game for you. This is number two. And I'm going to say this is worse than Sonic Boom Rise and Lyric. This is the worst game in history. Okay, I wouldn't say that bad, but still, Sega, what were you thinking? You just came off a of Sonic... Adventure 2 was so good. Sonic Heroes, wow, a masterpiece. Sonic 
Shadow the Hedgehog. Crap. Chaos Blast! Wait a minute. This is a game? Listen, basically most of the Sonic fan base hates this game. And honestly, don't comment down below in the comments something stupid, but I think this game looks good, and I might get it soon. I, I'm not joking, I might get Shadow of a Hedgehog, the game, because it looks pretty cool, and he's edgy, okay? I, we need more Shadow merchandise, and he's edgy. His second game in existence, a lot of people hate it, but I love it. So yeah, even though I've never played it, but it looks cool, and you guys better get it. Because if you guys don't get it, uh, there will be a centipede crawling on your face while you're sweeping. But if you do buy it, you'll get seven days of good luck. Try it, it really works. Not why. So, basically, this is not Sonic the Drug Free. This is just a video picture, but basically, what I'm saying is that, well, when I said there's going to be 10, um, the, they're already on number 6, I'm pretty sure. I'm going to just say, whenever we make it to the end of the video, when I feel like it, when we make it to the end of the video, then I'll say how many is. I know the thumbnail says how many there is, but just ignore the thumbnail. This video is supposed to be 10. This is supposed to be 10 Sonic, like, um, 10 best Sonic games, and 10 worst, the no, 10 best Sonic, 10, 10 Sonic games, but some of them aren't going to be, like, they're not going to all be 10, like, there'll be, there can possibly be 100, who knows anymore. Sonic Heroes. Well, basically we're getting in the middle of, like, how I'm good, and, like, we're in the middle, like, eh, it's alright. Sonic Heroes is, I guess... People say it's a good Sonic game, and honestly, I would say it's the best design of the Sonic characters. Yeah, the proportions just look like something good. I don't know why. It's just, I like that's my version. That's the Sonic I see in my mind. That's the Shadow I see in my mind. That's the Gamma I see in my mind. That's Rooster I see in my mind. Wait, why is she in my mind? Blah, blah. So basically, Sonic Heroes. Some people like it, some people don't. It's like in the middle. And that's why it's in the middle of this video. So yeah. Sonic Heroes, I guess you can say it's a good game. But not everyone in the whole world likes it. And now we're going to number 8. <laughs> So, my version of Sonic. I just like short, free-foot hedgehog with an attitude and long bl blue clothes. That's my version of Sonic. But, basically, I would say this might be... It's not my favorite Sonic game, but I would say it is my third favorite Sonic game. Yeah. I'm not joking, this is my third favorite Sonic game. Mainly because it introduced me to Sonic the Hedgehog. Well, it didn't introduce me, but it basically was my my actual very first Sonic game while I was in the Sonic. And I thought the graphics looked so cool, even though that was back in like 2016. So, yeah. I mean, it does look pretty good. But, at the very end of the video, nothing... And tell me otherwise. This one's the bang. Sonic Forces! One of people thought I was being sarcastic when I said Sonic Forces! But, no joke, Sonic Forces, a lot of people hate Sonic Forces, but Sonic Forces, at least to me, is the best Sonic the Hedgehog game ever made. And one, there's this one guy that, he's not mean or anything, but basically he commented that Sonic Forces isn't the best game in Sonic 3 and Knuckles is. 
So yeah, we're in the good category. It's hard to say it. Category. This basically we're in the good part. So this is like it should be number one, but since a lot of people hate the game, I'm not gonna put it at number one. But basically, the next one on our list is. Well, basically, this is my favorite Sonic game, but this is by what the Unin fans like. So yeah. <laughs> Sonic game, you guys are saying, no, Sonic Unleash was. When I, I said this, Sonic Unleash was my very first Sonic game while I was in the Sonic. My dad got me this one time on a little console, and it was just a little Sonic, it was just a little game for me. I knew who Sonic was, but I wasn't addicted to him as I am now. Sonic Free and Knuckles is a right game, I guess. It's pretty good. I would say Sonic Free and Knuckles is good, I guess. It's my one of my favorite classic Sonic games. But the next one is <gasps> Sonic the Hedgehog 2. Hmm. This is a sus game. So yeah, Sonic the Hedgehog 2. It's I played it before on the PS4. Well, not the PS4, PS3. And um, maybe I should put it. Near Sonic Rise of Weirix because to one of fans it's a good Sonic game. Introduces a new character named Tails, but I played it and it's alright, I guess. So yeah, I don't like it as good as Sonic Free and Knuckles, but it's alright, I guess. So that brings us to the next one that a lot of fans love Sonic Dash! I own this game on my dad's Android, his phone. And it's a good game. I've got to say, a lot of people say it's the best Sonic mobile game. And it's one of the only Sonic mobile games I've got in my life. So, yeah. I'm going to say it's a good game. It's alright. So, yeah. I recommend you guys can download this. And it is free. So, yeah. Go, what are you guys waiting for? Just download it. It'll give you some fun on a car trip or something. So, yeah. I recommend you get it. So yeah, let's go on to number, I forgot what I did. I'm going to have to go back behind the scenes and recount it. Oh yeah, I forgot to put Sonic 3D Blast in this video. This is me behind the scenes. I forgot to put this one in. But I don't really even have to talk about this game because we all know what it is. It's not good. It's slippery controls and... It's alright, graphics. It is Sonic's first step in 3D, but I don't want to talk about it. It's not a good game. I don't recommend getting it, but I already got it, so yeah. All Stars Racing! Yeah, Sonic All Stars Racing. Well, it's technically Zega All Stars Racing because it's almost every Zega character in a, in a cart, basically you rip off a Mario cart, and I'm gonna count it as Sonic because he is the main character in this whole game, so yeah. It's my, actually my second favorite Sonic game, or Sega game technically. So yeah, I really like this game, and you guys, I would recommend you guys buy it. It was not my first Sonic game, but maybe my second, third, yeah, my third Sonic game. And it's like, well, you know, I like it. I used to play it um, all the time. Now I just lost an X second controller, so I can't play two player with my dad and mom, so yeah. Sonic Mania. I have good times with making these um, Sonic Mania videos on my channel. I'm out of here. Yeah, I made that a meme. I made an animation of that. And I made a toy of that. And I made. This is a real life version of that. Oh, I'm going to do that. You guys, I shouldn't have told you guys that. But yeah, so basically, Sonic Mania, I have the game for $20. $20 I got it on the PC. And it's a good Sonic game. I recommend you guys buy it. It's my favorite, well, it's technically not Classic Sonic. Oh, it is Classic Sonic, but it isn't actually a 90s Sonic game. So I'm just going to say, eh. I guess it technically counts my favorite. It's my favorite classic Sonic game. Not actually 90s classic Sonic, just period classic Sonic. So yeah. 
Now we're going on to our two. There's two left. Sonic Adventure 2! I've played this game before, and it's a pretty good game. I recommend you guys get it. It's not that much. And it's pretty good. I like it. Sonic with the new soap shoes he had in that game. Never seen him again. And I mean, maybe Sonic Prime might have something similar, but we'll have to wait until Sonic Prime comes out. So, yeah. Basically, Sonic Adventure 2, it's a good game, but... Well, it's, I played it, but a lot of the Sonic fans love Sonic Adventure 2. And it used to be my favorite Sonic game, but then it changed to Sonic Forces when I played that game once. So, yeah. Infinite. Fast. Fast, fast. Watch out! You're gonna crash! Ah! Sonic Adventure! Some people say this is the best Sonic game to date, but I'm gonna say no. It's not the best Sonic game to date, and no offense, but it's to me, it's, I don't, I like the game, but it's not even in my top eight. It's in like my top six. So yeah, I put it at number one because a lot of fans like Sonic Adventure, but if I was actually rating it, I would put it at least number 11, and I don't know how many numbers this video I lost track so yeah this is the sonic news and technically the sonic news used to be a sonic show but now it's sonic news but this is not even actually sonic really news but there's no new sonic news to cover so i guess i'm just gonna do this so anyway hope to see you guys soon I'm not gonna say like and subscribe because I already said that at the beginning of the video. But if you guys forgot, like and subscribe because this is the number one source of anything Sonic in the galaxy. And if you don't like and subscribe, you're not gonna be a part of the Sonic Army. There's so much of us, and you better come on. Join the Sonic Army. And don't forget to ring the bell while you're at it. And if you don't ring the bell, you're going to make me cry. So, yeah. Bye.